How many times do we see in the book of Exodus the concept of God hardening Pharaoh's heart? In fact, Parshat Bo opens with that term. Bo el paro ki ani I will, I have strengthened his heart. And many ask, that, how is it possible that God strengthens Pharaoh's heart? That runs against a fundamental Jewish belief. In fact, one of the 13 principles is the principle of having this free will. People have the free choice to decide between good and bad. And without that, Maimonides says, it would not be fair to punish someone for doing something uh, since they didn't have free will. So how is God punishing Pharaoh? When, in fact, God is the one who hardened his heart. Furthermore, the Torah says, Boel paro, come to Pharaoh, ki ani chizakti et libo, for I have strengthened his heart. Really? What do you mean? If God has strengthened Pharaoh's heart, that's not a reason for Moses to come to Pharaoh. It's a reason for Moses to stay home in bed. Why would Moses go to warn Pharaoh and say, look, uh, let my people go. God is the one who already strengthened his heart. So what's the point at showing up in his palace? There's a beautiful explanation of the great rabbi of Sochachov, rabbi, the, the, the Shem Ishmuel he's called. And he says that really God gave Pharaoh free will. He left him with his free will. What God did is that no, a normal human being would have their free will tilted by the terrible plagues that arrived on Egypt. So... Pharaoh had free will, but he usually would have, his, a normal person would have his free will bent to the side by the terrible atrocities striking Egypt. And yet God put it back in the middle by hardening his heart and making Pharaoh sort of indifferent to the plagues that were arriving on Egypt. And so the Torah says God strengthened Pharaoh's heart, not to say that God took away Pharaoh's free will, but rather to say that God made Pharaoh able to sustain the pressure of the plagues. Now, why does that have to do with the first verse in the parsha? We can say, Vayomer Hashem el Moshe, God says to Moshe, Bo el paro, come to Pharaoh ki ani libo. I have hardened his heart, and therefore, giving him the command again will restart his free will, will start him on a blank slate. Since the last plague put his heart in a stiff place, now giving him the command anew gives him free will. When God commands us to do something, it also gives us the strength to do it. So God says to Moses, I want you to go command him because I kind of froze his heart before. I want you to command him and renew, start the engine again so that he can have free choice. I've hardened his heart, but I want you to restart it, give him the power to choose good and to do the right thing. Unfortunately, Moses does this, but Pharaoh does not listen again. And God says, I did that so that I can show you the miracles. Shabbat Shalom to all.